Alright. So this is not gonna be a very long whoops. Hold on. Hold on here. Um straighten her back out. Yep. She stood upright this time. Um, anyway. We're gonna take off. To go get... The new cedar. Um... I'm gonna be able to get this new cedar filled up and ready to rock and roll. I know this tractor is gonna have to um, do it. There's no way in heck anything else can. So, anyway. Put that up. Hold on, yeah. go. Got that one. I am loaded. Yep. There we go. All full. Buddy boy, I'm rough. Yeah, sure, that put us in debt real fast, but I can assure you that we're gonna be able to make that up. So, basically, this tractor is the only North American style to tractor that's on the farm except for the 78 and 10 but we'll be getting a better version of the 78 10 once we get going it's, yeah then it's gonna be whoa shift her down a few gears shift her down shift her down now i gotta shift her back up on on Not that. Not the new cedar home. No, no, I'm just gonna um, run it round back. Hopefully, I can park it on the back side of the barn. Oh, yeah, I can. Ooh. All right. Hold on. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't. 
Here is in the snap of the It's in the ladder. It's in the ladder of ages. Put it back here then. Um Damn. Just gotta um, situate some things. But yeah. Overall, basically the farm is nice and new now. Got a new tractor. Well, not really new, it's two months old. Two month old tractor. And then we got the farm max. And we also got our pottinger. So. Yeah, and I thought I'm gonna find that it's gonna come in real good handy. So whenever, whenever that happens. But anyway, hopefully we get around to combining soon. But don't think it'll be today or probably tomorrow because we'll still be going through. December and still gonna be ending up in Jan January and temp temps are not gonna get any warmer. And these things would still, if these things would just grow already, it would be such a big deal. So, and that wheat ain't gonna grow no more. It's too dang cold and a. Uh, yeah, so FS22, yeah, it's gonna be, yeah, it's great. So we'll see. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna go here. Probably next year will probably be. I don't know. Um. Thinking about doing soybeans on this field, and uh, yeah, soybeans on this field will do will do just nicely. Do nicely, and it's it's gonna be great. But can't plant them because it's too cold. Um, soybeans won't grow, grow anymore because it's too cold, and the wheat won't grow anymore because it's too cold. It's too cold. So that kind of sucks. It's pretty bad. But I'm actually kind of, kind of eager to test out the farm max. That's been something that I've been... Basically, been something that I've been wanting to test out for a long time, and um, today's not the day. Tonight's not the night to do, to do it. So, yeah. But oh man, I guess these soybeans won't be ready to go until next fall. It's my guess, which is my guess anyway. So. Um, I don't know, but anyway, yeah, but I guess that does wrap it up for today, for today's, for today's episodes, um, yeah, there's just nothing more really to say besides that there's there was changes made I sold the pickup because we won't be using that anytime soon and yeah switch some stuff around and yeah so I'm, I'm gonna call it so I'm gonna just 
shut her down here and and as always um see you guys Mm. Don't leave that door open. Oh, how are you mm. Mm. So anyway, yeah, go check out my channel at John Deere Man 17 and go check out all that great content and also subscribe and also subscribe to Iowa Country Farms because that's where all the great farming content will be and as always mm, see you guys tomorrow bye